Um, it's great to be with you, Benita. Congratulations, I should say, to all Israeli citizens. After four elections, after two plus years of just countless instability, we're in this place where finally we can say we have a government. Finally, we're able to go ahead and start a new chapter. We're able to go ahead and have a coalition that is the most unlikely bunch that you would have ever thought. Parties from the right, parties from the left, Arab parties joining, you know, the first time the Ra'am party joining the coalition. This is a government of all Israeli citizens, right, left, religious, secular, Jewish, Arab. This is a beautiful thing, a beautiful day, a chance to be able to look towards a government that's going to work for the economy, putting us back there again. It's just so amazing. I'm so happy right now, Benita. I can see that you look very happy. <laughs> Did you really think this was going to happen? I had a lot of faith, but you never know. You never know. I mean, you know, I, I was thinking about it just, you know, while I was coming into the studio. This is a historic moment. This is, you know, I had the honor and privilege to be running on a list where the leader of my list, Naftali Bennett, is going to be the next prime minister of the state of Israel. You know, to, to be a part of this historic moment is just an amazing thing. It's a humbling thing. This is someone, of course, that I've worked with for years who I know very well. And I know that we are getting such an amazing prime minister that just cares so much about all Israelis. It's just an amazing moment for for me, I'll definitely admit that, but I believe also for all citizens of Israel. Give us some personal...